Hi guys, it's Peter. Today I'd like to bring to you two things. One is then how do I normally test the apps and what kind of, let's say, major money management setups I use if I test a new algorithm or new app. And the second one is about this untraceable feature, which is part of Harvest app algorithm. As I said to you already, I received several emails from you asking is someone tracking our systems on online casino site can be then if i play long enough and i have a success with one algorithm can casino track my system and maybe do something about it either block me or maybe they will change a bit of outcomes of rng honestly i think if you really play in a fair casinos like poker stars casino club and so I really don't think that anyone would be managing or changing RNG outcomes because this would be really difficult for them. If someone find out a certain way, then they will be out of the business. And I really think they don't need it. For example, poker stars they use laser, they use laser beam how to generate RNG for poker hands, and the same or similar way they also use it for roulette. So I know that it's not major business for them. It's something what they have because people like it, but major business is poker. So I think poker star is absolutely 100% safe without any manipulation. But if you have some doubts and you would like to a little bit hide what you do and what is your system, because if you set up certain parameters and you constantly use the same parameters, of course, if you have some smart algorithms like artificial intelligence or machine learning, then these algorithms can find out what is most probably your idea or algorithm because they will do a reverse engineering of that. But I, I doubt that someone would invest so much effort and time to do it. But if then I introduced a certain untraceable feature for app and I within, let's say 30 seconds, I try to give you just quick info how it is done in Harvest App Plus. I also show you the major Many management setup which I test always with the new algorithm. So here is a very quick let's say explanation about this untraceable feature in the algorithm of Harvester app. So as you know, RI search start is automatic calculation, and it looks like that if the algorithm finds out and for example fixed pattern 0, 10, 20, 30 is having has the highest ratio like 0 0.25 might be the one which you will see like a prediction true is then to a little bit height then always do the same decision algorithm always with the highest ratio if some other fixed pattern has a similar ratio close to 0 0.25 like 0 0.22 or, or 23 then both patterns like also Star ending zero, ending three, both are let's say candidates for prediction because they have a similar ratio, and then both can be successful in upcoming spins. So I randomize the selection of these two if they are really close together based on certain settings and parameters in the app. I randomize the selection of these two. So as I repeat again, if the ratio is very close to each other, then I randomize the selection. So you might either play this pattern ending zero or this pattern ending three, but and no one can track it because it's using RNG actually deciding what will be your next fixed pattern to play. So both have a similar chance to hit and therefore I can randomize which one will be the pick one for the next play. And this is the way how it is, let's say, hiding an untraceable algorithm because no one can track and no one can really for sure say now this fixed pattern reached certain ratio and therefore will be picked for play. And now come back to the three basic money management setups which I test if I create a new algorithm and also for Harvester app you can try all of these three settings for Harvester app and see whether this will work for you or not. I had really good results so, for example, normally we play with some kind of spins and levels, balance from average. So my advice to you, if you test some new algorithms and you can 
of course test it in any app which you have from me and so on no problem so try for example spins 8 and levels 2 variance from average is 1 so it has no effect so if whatever you multiply 1 is still the same so and increase the progression aggressiveness to 6 percent so you can see then during the play the 16 spins your base bet will be simply growing a bit faster and you can also generate nice profit if you hit for example in the second part of your progression like in the second level the second setting is then i'm using standard progression aggressiveness around four percent again variance from average is just one so it's not having any effect but i'm playing with level one and spins 27 it's a bit long with 27 spins so it's long progression but true is then your success rate will be really high for example last test showed me then i was successful something like 250 times betting on predicted numbers and only seven times i was losing and the bankroll was in a nice plus and the third setup is something like you cut the spins to six but you play three levels so in total 18 spins and you keep normal progression aggressiveness and this time you also use variance from average 2.66 and land 2 is something like shows me the most reliable results not so expensive and also still very good results so i would say try these three settings for any app which you may might have from me also for harvester and see the results compare it try to maintain it. if you don't like 27 you can try 25 or something less less i would say spins like 30 35 it's simply too high and i think you your progression will be really expensive so i don't recommend to play 30 spins with four numbers this would be probably too much and the last few spins will eat a lot of of your bankroll if you are not successful so it's i found out in 27 for me it's maximum which i want to put into spins field so i can also generate some numbers i don't know the results how this will look like but true is then please if you want to try the systems the best way simply try these settings and see what will happen i would recommend to test always these three similar money management settings for your apps and harvester as well so of course we can continue and generate some more numbers maybe will end up in a minus who knows but in general as i said it's very good setup and i would really recommend you to try it so as you can see several times in plus there is a small minus it's no problem it's a test but as i said i'm going to play next sessions with for example this first setup it's more aggressive progression aggressiveness but no variance from average and also this one is also very stable so your success rate to win in 27 spins is really very high so thank you very much for watching this quite let's say quick guide and see you next time bye bye